If you've ever wanted to experience PlayStation games but didn't want to spend money on a dedicated console, we've got good news. PlayStation Now. Destroy! <laughs> All right. Nice. All right. Oh, I'm exhausted. Match. It's basically an app that streams a library of PlayStation games directly to your device without the need for a gaming machine. As long as your equipment can run the Now app and your internet connection is strong, you're in business. Sony announced that their cloud-based game streaming service is going live, so naturally we had to have a go. Right, so believe it or not, right now I'm playing NBA 2K14, uh, but I'm not playing on a PS4 or a PS3 or a 360 or anything. It's actually streaming right now through a Blu-ray player. So the whole thing is streaming online over the internet, just from an app on a Blu-ray box. It's actually pretty crazy. There's no disc, there's no, nothing in front of me. I just have a DualShock controller and that's it. Sony's obviously prioritizing smooth frame rates over high quality graphics, but the compromise means there's very little lag. It wasn't noticeable in any of the games we played, even Super Street Fighter 4. So there is, there is a, a loss of quality, but it's not, it's not crazy, not as bad as you would think, especially considering that you're streaming this and not taking anything off a disc. It's actually pretty good. I mean, there's some fuzziness around some of the players right now, but there's no lag. I mean, I'm not having trouble with any of the controls right now. I'm not calling any BS moves. It's certainly not the ideal way to play PS3 games, and those are the majority of supported games so far. But PlayStation Now is still an intriguing alternative for someone on the go or for non-gamers who just want to play a few titles without the big upfront cost of a console. Subscriptions to PlayStation Now will be $20 a month or $45 for three months. At CES 2015 in Las Vegas, for the International Business Times, I'm Vincent Balistrieri.